Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As always, I hope you guys are doing safe and well. Before we get into this video, please remember to subscribe and let me show you the Revolution Times Friends Collection Part 2. So I just want to let you know that these items are actually given to me by Han. So Han, if you're watching this, thank you so, so, so much. I am so grateful. You're amazing. Han knows me so well and she knows that I'm the biggest Friends fan ever. She literally sent me, guys, this yeah full of makeup what so i got pretty much everything from the friends collection and so much more things i'm just so grateful so thank you so much this is a very exciting video for me if you saw my birthday haul everything i got pretty much was friends related so this excited me very very much i won't be like doing tutorials and stuff like that i will be doing separate ones in the coming weeks so yeah also my eyelashes are falling off but we already know my life's a mess and I'm a mess, so we're just going to pretend like it's a normal thing for me. I mean, we don't even need to because it is a normal thing for me, so let's just roll with it and not comment on it in the comments. Thank you very much. Let's go on to the palettes first. The three palettes, which is the Lobster palette, the Classic Door Frame and the Taxi palette. These are retail at £20 each. Now, can we just listen i am the biggest revolution fan ever revolution are hands down my favorite brand ever and i love them so much but what i don't understand is why the like i love the packaging and everything obviously it's great the only thing is when i saw that these were 20 pounds each for each of the palettes and then they've got another face palette that's in the shape of a coffee cup i'm just used to having like four pound palettes from revolution do you know what i mean and then to 20 pounds is a massive jump i think i'd only pay it simply because it was friends palette if it was any other i wouldn't i feel like it's still affordable compared to like 50 60 quid palettes but from revolution we're not used to that so that is the thing you want to bear in mind. I know that at the moment, because of the Black Friday sales, they're about right £18 each. Then is the classic frame. And I don't know what material it is. Like, it's got the styrofoam. I don't know what it's called. But basically, it's not like a plastic palette, which mm, makes it feel a bit cheap. And for £20, you might be a little bit disappointed on first impressions so oh okay oh i like the fact that they've got these so you can swing the mirror around i love that the mirror is huge yeah, oh my god how satisfying was that if this is a palette i actually like the names of this palette and i think it's just such a pretty palette there's not much you can do with this palette in terms of crazy colourful looks apart from maybe this colour which is eggplant if you're into your nudes your pinks and things like that this is a really nice palette for you let's just take oh this is just screaming my name wow okay okay i was not expecting it to wow like are you wow um, as you can see, I'm a professional swatcher. Um, wow. Excuse That had no business being that pigmented. Okay, so maybe we can justify the £20 price with that pigment. Wow, that is so pigmented in one swatch. I cannot wait to create a look with this. Okay, maybe I spoke too soon story of my life <laughs> so yeah i love this as well and this is gonna go here i want it here in the background of my video how cute does that look is that just me or does it look cute it probably is just me but yeah okay maybe i was wrong it i'm not gonna lie it still feels a little cheap because of the material but i think we could justify the 20 pound price tag from first swatches again this is first impressions i'm not swatched all of them hey actually i've not even swatched a matte shade ever um let's go with this wow okay uh, a bit patchy let's try eggplant 
Wow. Oh my dizzy days. Again, what the hell is my hand doing? Again, professional, professional <laughs> sweatshirt. I'm just going to close this palette. Oh, oof. I'm okay. <laughs> okay, I think the £20 price tag is justified for this palette from first impressions. But let's see the other palettes. So it's cardboardy. I don't know. What am I doing? ASMR or what the hell's wrong with me? So I didn't really get the number plate like 020 i get like 2020 yeah what's rwb revolution oh revolution warner bros is it somebody from the team not that you're gonna watch this video but if you do let me know if i'm right thank you very much oh this is this is my kind of nudes you know don't even filthy minds anyway just so satisfying i love it okay wow the colors on this are gorgeous what is ensemble show what is 236 how's that related to friends 236 236 oh i like that my sandwich my sandwich they've got two my sandwich shades okay toilet seat cover <laughs> i like that New car scent, the last one, cable TV, pizza. Okay, gonna have to do a little swatchy swatch, ain't we? Oh, okay, still pretty. Oh, 236, which, can someone let me know? And let's try pizza. Feels so creamy. I mean, my hand's just a mess right now, so let's not even. It's got a mirror too, by the way. I'm just such a professional YouTuber, man. <laughs> So yeah, again, very nice shades. The foil shades feel brilliant. Oh, these feel more pigmented than the other one, but only the matte shades. The foils on the other ones, I feel are better. Um, what is this? Wow, look at my swatches, peace. Second palette, very nice. That is definitely a go-to nude palette shade, nude shade palette. I don't know what I'm on about. Nast, nast, but not neast. <laughs> last but not least also some of these i will be giving away so i can't wait to pop up in your inbox and if you haven't blocked me that is uh, pop up in your inbox and send you some of these again a huge mirror oh let's take it off satisfy you that's more stressful than satisfying okay what's barge what's barge please transponster is that you spelt wrong because it's transponster, not transponster with the D. It's not got the D in it. Thank you. Revolution, we will be having words. I don't know why with these palettes. I think it's because I'm such a huge Friends fan. I just have a bit of an issue with some of the names. It smells. I don't know why I even smelled it. Spray tan looks... Wow, okay. Okay, guys, you know what? look at these foil shades again absolutely beautiful some of the matte shades okay this is a hundred wow and matte shades are 100 percent better than the other two palettes from swatches foils are about the same first palette was insane i didn't think i would use this palette much because of the shade range but if the mattes perform like that I'm gonna have to do a look on this as well. So uh, they're the three palettes. I then got sent the fizzes. There's two more. There's a marshmallow one and one with Marcel on it as well. And these are bath fizzes. These are five pounds each. I feel like if these were bath bombs, it would have been better. But again, for a fiver, it's like lush prices, isn't it? So yeah, and I'm guessing, can you use these more than once? And break it up and use it in several baths instead of just at the same time. But yeah, I will be giving these away as well in one of your lot's inbox. So definitely follow me on Instagram. I will be sending these out to one of you guys. So I really hope you enjoy them. So excited about grab a cup. I'm just going to rip this off, guys. I'm just going to be honest with you. I didn't realise. So obviously this is a coffee cup that you can reuse. And it's 
a plastic one as well. This is a, actually a body scrub. I mean, that could have had some work done on it. <laughs> that is just in a pain bag. It's £15 and I've seen so many people say it's just expensive. But I guess with the coffee scrub and the fact that it's reusable, it is good. I think the £10 mark more suitable and a lot more better for what it is basically. I wanted to give this away but I, I can't part with it guys, I can't. It's just so cute. I'll be having my coffee in the morning, like, thanks Han. Enjoy my coffee and be a boss ass. But moving on. Next thing is espresso body butter, which can we just say, when I was younger I thought it was espresso, like it was in express yourself. So, I now know it's espresso. So this is a body butter. I'm gonna be completely honest. Look, I'm just being so brutal in this video, which trust me guys, I love Revolution, so, and like I said, I'm not here to BS you, so I hope you appreciate it. This is eight pounds. I, I'm just gonna be brutally honest. I don't see the need for this. Like I don't, I get maybe, okay, with the body scrub and the bath fizzes, but I just don't see the need for it. Like, right, this should have been a coffee mug. Oh my God. Imagine if they did a coffee mug with like hot chocolate and you know, like those coffee mugs that are, that come pre-made with, not pre-made, but like with the chocolate and marshmallows and stuff in that. I would pay, that I would pay like 10, 15 quid for. I mean, I'm gonna use it. <laughs> like I'm not being ungrateful in any way. I'm just being honest. Had I bought these with my own money, had they been gifted to me by Revolution themselves, I would have told you the same thing. I don't really get it, do you know what I mean? I love this packaging, by the way. And once it's gone and once it's used, I will use it for my hijab pins. I think that would be so cute. I did not realize it was open. Oh, uh, um. Okay, I'm not keen on the smell of that, if I'm honest. Just didn't smell sweet for me. Obviously, I'm gonna use it, I've got it, but yeah, like I said, once I've used it all, I will be using it for my hijab pins and accessories. I think it was so cute. Oh my god, that's just going to look so cute. I wish I was on the Revolution team to create this line because oh, I just love friends. I love Revolution. Why am I about to cry? Why am I getting teary? I wish I was on the team to create this line. I love friends. I love Revolution. I love makeup. I love skincare. I love it so much. Okay, last up, we've got possibly my favourite, the lip mask in caramel latte and the lip scrub in vanilla latte. And these are £5 each. So this pink one is the lip mask and the black one is the lip scrub. And as you can tell, I think you can, they're matte, matte lid, which I really, really like. So let's open the lip mask. Oh, I like the fact that they've got that on it. Oh my god, I don't know if you can tell. I've just made it pink, but that is so creamy. Oh, that's nice. I put it on my lips right now, but I'm not gonna. This one just fell out. Look how satisfying I knew that is. It's taking me a bit of force to. That's quite harsh, but then again, it's a lip scrub smina. What do you expect, man? I really like these. I would pay money for these, especially this. So smooth and buttery. I need to know recipe for this because wow, it's just, it's a mix between Vaseline and Carmex. Like it's so buttery and smooth. I would 100% buy this over and over again, just simply on first impressions without even putting it on my lips. Like, hello? Who is she? <laughs> That's it for this video, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed the first impressions of Revolution and Friends Series 2 collection. I really enjoyed doing this video. I cannot wait to use the palette. I will do a separate video on each of these palettes and tell you how I like them, tell you how they perform. So do look out for that. Please remember to subscribe and I really hope you enjoyed this video guys. Please look after yourselves and I'll see you in the next one.